All right, it's the video everyone's been asking for for a little bit now with 187 comments, a good majority of them ending with people asking me to do an updated video on the crew and where they actually are now. So we're going to do it. Today I'm going to go over the crew, the old uh, the old crew, KYR Speedy, Jehovah, Deluxe 4, actually sidearms this time, I'm not going to forget them this time, Legion, D20, G18, everybody, literally everybody I'm going to cover this time that needs to go. Now I'm not going to cover the side people this time, like I was going to cover uh, Miss Heart Attack or uh, straight up Knives, but uh, I don't really count them because that was a long, long time ago. I'm just going to go over the crew members, the main guys, go through all of their channels, take a look at what they're doing in 2021 update. Um, I'm not going to hold back. I, I know that the criticism for the original video was the fact that I was harsh on them because their videos weren't getting as many views as they had subs uh, uh, in a ratio style. So we're going to go through it again, and I'm going to see if they've even uh, increased since the last time. So we're going to have the old video here. We're going to look at their views, look at the videos, and see if anything's really changed. So uh, if you guys enjoy, obviously you can hit that like button. Guarantee most of you are going to end up hitting to dislike him, leaving a comment about how much I suck because I insulted your favorite YouTubers. But hey, these guys were also my favorite. This is a nostalgia thing. I still do watch them. That's the thing. So I have a bit of insight this time around instead of last time where I wasn't watching them at all. I've done my research this time. We're going to be we're going to be thorough. All right, let's get into the video and start with KYR Speedy. All right, starting off with Speedy's main channel. I have a lot of uploads in the last few months, but it's been three months since his last one. So... Three months ago, he was three or four months ago. Actually, he was posting a lot of best ofs, a lot of compilations. Um, geez, Fall Guys is one of his old videos. I actually haven't seen anything past where we were last time, but I've seen everything up to where we are now. So he has the best of the crew: 176,000 views, 147,000 views, 146, 151, 79 on Rainbow. Rainbow isn't as popular on YouTube right now. Fall Guys about halfway through its popularity. 164, 140, 96 on a shoutcast. Maybe not as popular as the rest of the videos because the rest of them are generalized videos. So he's in the hundred thousands. He's averaging a hundred thousand, 150,000 views per video. His second channel is a completely different story. We will get to that. When we talked about his channel last time, let's take a look here. Let's take a good look. 211,000. That was three weeks ago. If that was. Uh, a best of the crew generalized. We'll pass over that. 70,000 on For Honor. 161,000 on the CSGO Funny Moments. We go forward a little bit. We should be able to see his full catalog here. 200,000, 129 on Friday the 13th, which was a dead game then and a dead game now. Um, these were a month apart, and some of these were close proximity. So, yeah, it, not a lot has changed in his main channel view count. I know that he doesn't upload to his main channel as much because a lot of his main channel videos get demonetized, and I do understand that he streams a lot on Twitch, a lot on Twitch. He streams every single day, I believe at 2 p.m. Eastern, so a lot of his source comes from there, a lot of his source income comes from there, a lot of his main views come from there, his main channel is the one where he uploads the best of the compilations and everything. It makes a whole lot of sense. So we go to his second channel, 2.3 million subs. He posts way more regularly, three posts today. This is where combined views become more. His combined views on a single day make up for what he's doing over here now. He got 67,000, 56,000, 71,000, but these all added up in a single day. You're going to end up over 200,000 views if you count in a single day. In a single week, over a million. He's doing really good on the second channel. People come to the second channel for the nice variety. Everything is looking good. He posts so frequent over here that it's not even a problem for him anymore. So we take a look at those second channel views. Pop over to his second channel. Is this it right here? Look at all that. Lower views on his second channel videos when I did this video in March of 2019. He's coming up. He's picking up again. Look at that. That was an hour ago on this one. And that was just a live stream announcement. So we're not going to count that one at that point. With three hours, uh, 9.6K. Come over here to his second channel. This was three hours ago, 13K. His views on his second channel have gone up substantially. Uh, a good percent of his videos are now doing much better. Uh, his videos have been increasing in quality, and the thumbnails are fantastic. Great SEO on these thumbnails. People want to click on these thumbnails because of how great they look. The art on these is fantastic. The content is fantastic as well. The quality of the content is really good. He's been keeping it up. Look at all these views. Look at all these videos. 
Some of these series have been great. All of these series are great, honestly. Speedy's been doing great, as always. He was doing a little down in 2019, early 2019, but that's how it goes early in the year. Your videos, your views are down. Your videos are coming out maybe a little bit less. Um, your money's coming down on YouTube. YouTube at the beginning of the year has horrible CPM. Uh, you con uh, content creators like to take a lot of breaks during the beginning of the year because a lot of their money is down. So they stream a whole lot more. They'll make up for it somewhere else. In this case, Speedy's doing great on videos, second channel, and main channel, plus Twitch streaming, doing fantastic. And now we're going to move on to Jehovah. All right, now we're moving on to Hova's channel. Hova's channel, it's decently active in the last couple of months here. Yeah, a month ago, a week ago, a month ago, a month ago, a month ago, three months ago. Uh, oh, sorry, it says two months ago, two months ago, two months ago, two months ago. Yeah, he posted a lot in bulk, and it kind of died for a month or two, and then came back with some new stuff, Pokemon openings, very popular, very popular now as they were about a month or two ago. A lot of people opened that stuff up, 1.56 mil. Hova did leave the crew, so he's no longer in the group of people anymore. It's more of a, a more of a solo venture right now with a couple of friends here and there. Obviously, it's a big thing. Um, everyone would know why he wanted to leave. I've explained it a million times. There's a lot of things going on personally for Hova. He's got kids. He had a... He had a divorce going on at that time. The guys were playing at different times than he was. They're playing late into the night. He can't stay up that late. He's got other things to do. So he had to take a break. That's all speculative, by the way. I don't know what I'm saying about what happened between them. It's 100% true. So I just want to keep that straight facts out there. Um, Hova's second channel, we'll go back to the first channel views in just a second. This is Hova Flip's channel, completely different from gaming, completely different idea and everything. There was a little bit of a break here. So I will talk about this shortly. So back to the main channel views. Um, wow. Uh, a week ago, 5.2K, uh, 5.4K, 3.3K Pokemon boxing a month ago. A single thousand view, like not even double digit thousand views on anything. Wow, I didn't even realize that until I re-looked at it again. I thought there was at least a 10,000 in here somewhere, but I guess I was wrong. Hova's main channel, comparison to last time we looked at it. Four days ago from when I did that, 3,000, 15K, 2K, 12K. He even said he was moving to Mixer. Yikes. The hindsight was was 2020 on that one, if, uh, if I do say so myself. But looking at it here, um, he was doing okay. He had... He had, a, he had a higher views then than he does now on his main channel. I didn't look at his second channel back then. So, if we come on down to about um, almost a year and a half, almost two years now. Um, he was pulling in about the same single, th single thousand views, no double digits, no ten thousands in bulk at least. There could be a straight one, a ten thousand here instead. Hova's views have died off. He did major variety content. He's working on his the secondary business with his eBay selling that he had going on to the storage and everything. And he's doing Pokemon cards and stuff now, selling all that stuff. His eBay hauls and everything and everything that he sells. It's a different venture. It's a different thing. He used a pre-existing channel to build this channel. His second channel turned into Hova Flips. I believe that is on that is correct on that. There is no other second channel besides this one. And I remember that I was I was I was subscribed to this one. I am not anymore. So I'm definitely thinking that this was his second channel. So just the thousands of views, the random stuff from the eBay store that he's running, selling and everything. Not a whole lot going on. Six hundred and sixty thousand subs. Uh two mil total, two point one mil total on here. Not really good. Hova hasn't been doing good in the view department. His streams, something I do not watch. He know he, I know he streams very often, but I uh, I do look at his view count when I'm in there. Under 100. 150 maybe max sometimes. He doesn't do it as often anymore. So Hova's views have dropped off since last time a lot. That's where he is now. He could come back, could make a thing. There's it's Fortnite. <laughs> is Fortnite still a thing? I have no idea anymore. I'm not keeping up with it. But as of right now, uh, Hova's really yeah, lacking in the view department everywhere. I, the views are not everything, and I will say that multiple times throughout this video. Views are not everything. Not everything amounts to views, so long as they enjoy what they're doing, it doesn't matter. I am just looking at facts here, saying that their views for Hova right now, down since the last time I looked at them in March of 2019.
Now we're moving on to Mr. Nobody Epic. Nobody has two channels, one that's been inactive for uh, a really long time, so I'm just going to look at that, just to look at past analytics versus what they are now. Um, he also doesn't post on his YouTube channel very often. Now, if you're not familiar with everything, uh, he streams on Facebook gaming. He's been doing that for a very long time since I've, he was even doing it when I was doing my last video. So I completely missed that. I didn't know he was streaming. I thought he just fell off the grid. His last post was from a year ago. We go back to this video. It was about two days ago from March 9th. So it was around March, 2019. He was pretty active. Thousands of views, uh, 10, 000, 12, 10, eight. I think some of the ones down here had uh, seven or eight, but I didn't scroll down from there. He had some stuff going on, but he was contemplating leaving at that time. He didn't really know what to do at the time. But Facebook gaming is hopping off. He's been doing really good on that. We're focusing on YouTube for this stuff. I will talk about the Facebook stuff, but I mean, actually, can we find those videos? Yeah, they stayed about around that same thing. So YouTube, not his main focus, probably 100% the reason why it uh, it isn't like it is anymore. Um, I don't want to compare it to his popular videos or anything because I don't think like that's fair anymore from what the content was peak then and what was going on then and the popularity definitely factored into it. Nobody Extra has been inactive for four years now, so this doesn't even count. We'll get rid of that there. Nobody doing great on Facebook, not as good on YouTube. He's still holding it together. Probably still one of my favorite members of the crew. Love him to death. He's doing good on Facebook. I'm glad he is. Streaming's doing great for a lot of these guys. All right, and we'll move on to our next person the deluxe four all right for those of you who are big fans of deluxe four his content has changed a lot since the last time that we talked about him right now if you go to his channel he's all among us main in that among us for the last couple of months right that among us high what like a lot like a whole lot before that he was doing a good bit of variety holding into some similar games as pokemon a series for everything her uh, minecraft was doing really good it was it was a fun time to watch all of that and then among us hit it was big he was hitting multiple tens of thousand view videos 50ks here 25s the thumbnail uh was working for him the thumbnail style was working the, these art styles were killing it on youtube at the time trending tab was a trending tab especially for gaming which was filled with these cartoonists uh among us thumbnails and it was just it was doing great like look how similar these are eye-catching popping people are going to click on these and it worked for him he got his views were definitely 100% up from the last time we talked about him. I didn't talk about uh, a single game last time, but the videos that we were talking about were right about here. So 19,000 views, 11,000 views. This is months after these videos are hitting that many views, not even half of the time now. So uh, a year ago, he was hitting and out videos that have been out for a year have 11,000 to 15,000 views. This is a month ago, it's got 15,000 views and it can keep going up from there. All of these videos, he even has a couple of Rust videos here and there through here which is fantastic his second channel we talked about last time is his red dead 2 channel inactive not doing anything on that anymore but as uh, the other guys have been doing deluxe is all about that stream life streaming all the time doing great deluxe does great on streams uh his streams are very entertaining with everybody else with the guys even if they're solo streams really good everyone in the crew blanket statement doing great with streaming if they're streaming a lot if they're not streaming a lot not as good if they're streaming a whole lot doing really good among us killing it for the lexus channel right now i went more in depth with everybody else at the start because i feel like those are the people last time that i gave a little bit too much criticism to and deluxe was kind of the same in the sense but i want to pick up the pace because i don't want to make this video a half hour long i want to make this an easy to digest update video for everybody so deluxe four doing real good and now we're going to cover sidearms because I didn't cover him last time. I know. I'm sorry. I don't know how I forgot him, but we're going to get to him right now. Sidearms for a reason. Doing fantastic on YouTube right now. Didn't talk about him last time. Didn't give him a voice last time in the videos. That's why he's the ever silent. Killing it right now. 27,000 views, 25K average per video from a day ago, day ago, two days ago. Uploading almost every single day that he can. Absolutely knocking out of the park, plus the streaming side at one of the more popular of the crew streamers doing absolutely fantastic road that Among Us wave playing code names and Minecraft Purge series now with everybody else. Loving it. This Minecraft Purge series is really good if you guys haven't checked that out. More code names. Code names is getting big on is getting a, a big uh, burst on Twitch right now. Very fun game. Very fun board game in real life if you haven't played it. Definitely a lot of these guys rode that Among Us wave for a while. These eye-catching videos that you can do. If they ever go back to Call of Duty, get them a little bit of view boost. That's their roots. That's where they like to come from. 
But yeah, these Among Us videos, fantastic things to do. Side killing it on the stream game and on the YouTube game. He doesn't have a second channel. Rocking that 1.01 million. Just barely holding on to that mill up there, Side. Hope you're doing good. It's doing good right here with all these among, old Among Us videos. Grabbing in views every month. Also, this new stuff is hitting about the same amount of uh, views. Doing much better than last time because there was no metrics from last time. So, uh, <laughs> size just doing really good right now, and I'm really glad about it. Also, don't know if you noticed yet, no script for this. I like going off the cuff. I did the research beforehand for the last like month or two to get ready for this, but I don't like having scripts for stuff. You guys know this. We're just going to keep rolling and move on to D20 and G18. All right, now we're going to rapid fire style it right here, both Deluxe 20 and G18 at the same time. Uh, Deluxe doesn't stream at all. He doesn't have a Twitch channel or anything like that, so... Not a whole lot going on here. He's uploaded some Among Us here and there. Kind of on a break right now. His last video was in the thousands. Not doing a whole lot. He rode the wave of those big games in the summer, like Among Us and Fall Guys, and then absolutely jumped off. That ladder up here just hopped off, did, did a 360 gainer off the Empire State Building. Not doing real good right now. And views wise, he's not uploading. That's probably why. G18, on the other hand, hasn't uploaded in seven months, but streaming is his thing. Y'all don't know, I didn't know for the longest time, he actually had a face reveal. He had his face in his Twitch streams. Didn't know that, weird thing, didn't even know that was a thing. Uh, g 18 is doing good in the stream game. Not as much on YouTube because yeah, YouTube's not the main source, you know? Some people don't need to upload all the time, but when he was, he was doing really good. He was in about the same numbers as the guys were now. I would hard expect him to have the same numbers if he decided to come back. All right, last and certainly not least, we got the best person, in my opinion, that I liked the most, the daddy darling himself, Legion. Legion has been doing good over in the Twitch game, like really good over in the Twitch game. He streams a lot of Warzone. Yeah, that's basically it. A lot of Warzone, a lot of Call of Duty Cold War that just came out in the last couple of months. He's been playing a lot of that. He did some IRL videos in there. His TikTok kind of blew up. I don't really use TikTok that often, but apparently he does a lot of good stuff on there and people like to watch that. He still does his impressions, which were probably my favorite thing that he used to do. His old Cleveland Brown impression and everything was probably my favorite stuff. Uh, yeah, like I said, he does some IRL stuff. He does the COD Zombies. He does the Call of Duty still. He's one of the ones that still does mainly Call of Duty stuff on his channel and on his stream. I know some of them still play Warzone on stream and stuff like that, but like if you look at it, he's the one that does it on both, and he's been killing it in both. Um, his numbers are they're okay. He's in the he's hitting the teens, the the teens thousands, and he's also hitting like 27 here at 16. Uh, he, he's averages around 25 to 35,000 views per video, which is fantastic for someone who's been on the platform for this long with under a million subscribers still, which I still think he's super underrated and should have more subscribers on him. Legion's fantastic. Absolutely love the guy. Doing great. And that's it for the crew. We went over everybody. Everyone's doing good in their own way. And I think that's something I missed during the first video is that everybody here is doing their own thing. They're happy about what they're doing. And that's what really matters in the end. I know that numbers don't mean everything, but I always like to go back and look at the people that I used to watch coming into YouTube before I did YouTube and why I do YouTube. If the crew never happened, I would not be doing YouTube. And that's one of the things that I always like to talk about and think about is the fact that these guys made me almost who I am online today because of their videos. I absolutely love them. Let me hear you guys' crew stories down in the comments below. I, I know you guys are pretty opinionated on the crew and everything because you guys also grew up with them like I did. If you were born in the early 90s to the 2000s like I was, you definitely watched these guys in middle school, early high school, and loved every second of it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys enjoyed this video, please slap that like button down below. Hit that subscribe if you're not subscribed already, and hit that bell so you get notified for the next video. New videos coming out the pipeline very, very soon. Thank you guys so much for watching, getting your daily dose of vitamin P. If you guys want more daily doses of vitamin P, please check out the rest of the videos on my channel, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out, and take care.